Hey guys, welcome back to more SpongeBob. I'm going to an oil rig. Sweet. SpongeBob needs to get some downy and clean up this oil spill. I don't think anybody's ever said we're going to an oil rig and the reply has been sweet. That was the first time ever. <laughs> Alright boys, saddle up. We're going to an oil rig to work for six months. You're going to have no contact with the outside world. Yay! Hey, I can't wait. Dude, it would suck to work on one of those things. You get paid really well. A lot can go wrong, though, really quickly. I mean, isn't that true with literally any job? I guess. I mean, I'm like, sitting here playing video games and a lot could really go wrong right yeah, now. Yeah, like, what if a satellite fell out of orbit and crashed directly into us, killing us instantly? Oh, that would suck. It's so likely, man. Like, that, you wouldn't believe it. That would be the extreme. I love the flame effects. It's like... It's, it's, they're magical flames, they appear out of nothing. They are kind of cool, actually. They actually look better than anything else in the game. I, I feel like they... a lot of this stuff, like that, from this game has been taken from stock footage. Oh, for sure. But I feel like it might also be the most high-res. Oh, man. Ray was there. Why did that jellyfish take five billion years to rise? I thought I was just supposed to drop. You did save before this, right? Yeah. Okay. How many lives do I have left? One. I got this. Don't get hit by the steam so much, Ethan. You're gonna have to blow off some steam, SpongeBob. That kind of oh Wait, wow, instant death for those. That's things. wow. So just time it out correctly. That's kind of brutal. Oh, the steam doesn't even affect you. No, the quabs do though. See, doesn't this look like something you could ground pound? Yeah. Or it's just go down closing those vents? That's like what I thought was gonna happen. Not a fan of the fire, since it's insta kill. Fire bad! Do, 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 do. Man Ray! There is my jellyfish. Right. Man Ray! How did you get down here? I feel like there's an evil clone army of Man Ray. There's another one down there to the left I saw. Along with the checkpoint. Whoa! <laughs> that was pretty ridiculous. The spinning effect. Now, I'm gonna grab myself what I expect to be a life. No. I'm surprised, honestly. You gonna play this one safe, huh? Oh yeah, I want all the spatulas I can get. I think next level's the boss. That would be final boss? I wonder if it'll be Man Ray. When we just shoot him one time and he dies. Does he have a, a coal villain? I don't or... think so. Okay, so it's just him. He's like the number one villain, right? Alright, those checkpoints were unnecessarily close. There was literally two jumps between them. Right. They must have thought those jumps were really hard. That's the end, I think. The end is near. That homeless guy in New York was onto something. <laughs> I mean, every homeless guy in New York is onto something. That was a jellyfish before, wasn't it? Whoa. I don't know. I didn't see. Good old leap of faith there, wow, okay. Oh, yeah, you really gotta put some faith in this game for this part. At least the bottom kinda looks like oil, it's like a greenish oil. Yeah, I can see it. You know what's one thing I do appreciate about this game? What? You don't slide when you're running. You either, it's, it's stop go. There's no, like, sliding when you let go of oh, I suppose, that's nice. Another checkpoint. Whoa, I didn't expect that to happen. I thought that would did. kill me, honestly. Um, now this level is becoming confusing. Oh, there's the thing. Why I think would that's I the exit. Why would I ever go down there? I need a monkey wrench. Nice. Elevator, why? Make sure and save it. You have zero guys right now. 
I wonder if there were two ways to get there. Like, if I could have come in from the bottom and got, gone up the elevator to get oh, to the end. Oh, that could be. Our next level. The canning factory. This boss is about to get canned. You think this is a boss right now? Boss has been in the fourth level for the last three stages. Does not look like a boss. Looks okay. like an actual stage. You've said that every for the last three boss stages as well. That's why I really know it's a boss stage. Alright, we'll see. You think that water hurts? Or water. I don't see any water. You know, All the dripping? Water? Nah. You know, you never know with this game. I don't know, that's very hard to see. I bet those hurt down there. <laughs> you could try it. Uh, I'm gonna guess those are instant death. Yeah, for sure. We'll never know unless we try it, though. Well, you tried it. <laughs> oh, they're not instant death. Those are like Indiana Jones platforms. They suck in. Have you played the Indiana Jones Super Nintendo game? Is it trash? There's two levels that just are infuriating. One where you're running from a boulder because you can't see in front of you at all, and you just have to guess at the jumps. That sounds like trash. It's worse. It's worse than the crash boulder level? Yeah, because you're running... It's, you'd have to experience it. And then there's Ooh. another one where you have to go in all these doors, and you don't know which door is going, and they all take you to all these different places. It's just like the most annoying maze ever. I mean, the crash boulder level is pretty bad. We can both agree on that, right? We could play it. It'd be kind of a fun thing, because I... I like the game as a whole, there's just a couple parts that suck. You made it sound like you've already played it though. I, well, I have a long while ago on stream. Uh, see how those platforms suck in? They're like super Indiana Jonesy. Oh yeah. We could play all those if you want. They're actually alright. The Aladdin game is, is alright. The Indiana Jones game is alright. The Lion King game sucks major balls. Those are the, like, the ones that I can kind of think that are comparable in how they work. At least right now. It'd be kind of fun to do a, a series on old movie-based games. Just like real old ones on the Super and the Nintendo and stuff like that. And just, just play through them. Some of them are surprisingly good. Others are terrible. Just absolute garbage. I can see that. Should Spongebob get flattened out here? Whoa, upside down face! I like how quickly it stops. I've never seen him do that in the show. I don't know if he has done that in the show. Oh, almost bang. Almost missed that. Nice. This is actually a really cool level. This might be my favorite level so far. Whoa, that's a vent. Yeah, it is. Whoa, that's crazy. What is this, an auto level? This is kind of cool. Give me my 9 billion spatulas back, please. I just lost like half of them. I actually almost had Oh, you should have won right away. That has hit detection, not squish detection. So if you run into the side of it, it counts. Whoa! This level is actually pretty cool. Oh, yeah. Don't get pancaked. Nice. I'll pancake myself all I want, man. Sponge cakes. Some people Delicious. really like pancakes. Oh, we got a final boss, maybe? The Iron Dogfish? Um, we've heard about this thing, but never really seen one ourselves. Who ever heard of a dog living underwater, anyway? I'd, uh, sooner expect to see a squirrel doing karate. So cool. Cool, thanks for the, thanks for the tips. It's not a tip. <laughs> yeah, right? I'm gonna take a. I'm gonna take a drink of water. So I'm gonna tell you how to beat this boss right now. He's a friendly looking fella, but don't let his friendliness fool you. Good luck. That's like giving that for a All tip. Right. So here's the Konami code. You gotta. You gotta do the thing with the controller, and you get stuff. And press some buttons in there. Yeah, exactly. Good luck. Figure oh, do you have to steam him? You might have to steam him. I need to blow off some steam. I have to steam him. We're steaming a dogfish, guys. I went fishing for dogfish one time. They kind of look like catfish. After I steam them, I have to hit him somehow. Pretty sure. Maybe butt slam? Oh yeah, he stays, like, frozen. 
for yeah. a second. But he's got spikes on his head, so I don't know if the butt slam. Yeah, it's butt slam. Did we lose audio? I think we lost audio, but I hope the people did not lose audio. Because I can't stop it right now. Can't stop, won't stop. TikTok on the flat because the party don't stop. Why is this the most pushover boss so far? Here, give it a pause really quick. Let me fix the audio, just to make sure. Alright. Okay, we're back with audio. I don't know if we lost it before. And this boss is going down. Oh, you almost got him. Honestly, he's really easy. Yeah, he looks really easy. Because he can't hit me. They didn't give him a way to get up here to hit me. He pretty much hits you every time when you uh, butt slam, though. Does that matter, though? No. Exactly. You always get that one spatula back. It's actually five, it's just they become bigger when they're five. Oh, it's a bundle. You ordered it in bulk. A couple more hits and we got them. Got them. Nice. Bouncing for victory. Also, where's the end? There it is. I got it! Ah! Well, celebration time is over. Now back to Bikini Bottom to add the finishing touches to my birthday surprise. Is that it, or is there like a final, final boss? There's probably a cutscene. There's a final boss that's a minigame to fix Mermaid Man's TV. <laughs> ah! Anybody around here need a TV fixed? Nope, just force that there, hit that, twist that, and put that there. Congratulations, Spongy Blob. You earned this. Patrick is lucky to have a friend like you. Gee, thanks. Well, I've learned today that friendship is something that is priceless. SB is not such a bad sponge after all. SpongeBob SquarePants! Wait till I get my hand in that porous freak! Wow. Dude, he kind of deserves it. Yeah. They were kind of tools to us the entire game. <laughs> yeah, they made us do a lot of stuff for a measly autograph. Two measly <laughs> autographs. Yeah, whatever. It's not even Patrick's birthday. He's gonna go sell it an e. He's gonna go sell it an e sponge for like five million dollars. Yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday, Patrick! From all your friends in Bikini Bottom. Today's my birthday. Huh. I thought I was born a long time ago in a hospital. Thanks for the signed photo of my favorite superheroes. Anyhow, this is the best birthday ever! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Meow, 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 meow! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Stand still while I take your picture. What a weird ending. Yeah, and my bad. It's not E-Sponge, it's Seabay. Okay, um, you're bad. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Also, we had a Squidward sighting for the first time. Yeah. <laughs> he can't resist the cake. No, he can't. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. Ethan, final thoughts? Happy birthday. Happy birthday.